it's a little bit shorter on that one because uh, I'm, I'm going to go back now down to Cafe 55. Hello? Hello, JD. Yes, hello. Um, I will hand you over to the lady in charge of Cafe 55 and she can tell you all about it. Okay. Hello there. Hiya. Uh, who are you? Uh, my name is Jane Tucker and I manage Cafe 55 here in Exeter. That's great. I actually loved coming down there. It's one of my favourite places of Exeter. Oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. Um, <laughs> a lot of people say um, it's a very bright, cheerful and welcoming place, I think. Um, it's a very inclusive cafe. We get all walks of life coming into the cafe, uh, which we positively encourage. Mm-hmm. So, but I think that sort of um, is verified by the atmosphere in here as well. well very friendly. Uh, well, the atmosphere is it's nice and quiet. You can actually hear yourself converse <laughs> with somebody because some places you just can't go into because they're clashing and bashing and what have you and you don't hear that down there no i know well we do tend to keep it quite quiet because an awful lot of our customer base are deaf blind and disabled people mm, yeah. um and a loud telly or music as well is mm. quite um distracting yes it um, is, so yes. we do try to keep it quite quiet we mm-hmm. also get quite a few students down here studying and using our wi-fi <laughs> yes <laughs> Well, that's on the way, isn't it? From the yeah. from the where they um, go to college to town, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. We've also got um, a digital magnifier, which is a very nice piece of kit, which is for the older person who can't read bills or or see photographs or something. So it sort of it magnifies oh, normal print. So that's that's for people's use as well in the cafe. Oh, that's great. And, and is it sort of aids? You see, that's some of the cafes don't do that. They don't have aids to actually help those who are disabled in any way. No, they don't. Um, but again, we we positively encourage all all different sorts of support for various people. I mean, yeah. as you know, we've got signs on the wall with various mm. BSL sign mm-hmm. for cake and biscuit etc so um an awful lot of the staff sign as well so mm-hmm. again it's, it's a very encouraging environment and we do all we can to make everybody feel welcome right yes well that, that's that's the nice thing about it is homely and i like yes. homely homely places yeah it is homely you're absolutely right and somebody can always drop in for a cup of tea or coffee and have a chat and you know because everybody's very accommodating it's mm. a very fun place to work as well mm. for our volunteers mm. All you need is some, some some sort of lift outside to pull those people in wheelchairs up the hill afterwards. <laughs> so, but Chris can do it, I know, but uh, a lot of them struggle up there, and I, I, I do feel sorry for them. <laughs> I, know, I know, there's nothing we can do about the, um, the camber of the pavement, no, unfortunately. No, no, but um, it's not too bad, no, it's, it's not too bad, and no. it doesn't tend to be anything in the way of anybody no, that's, coming down no, here. And you've got disabled parking outside, which is wonderful. Yeah, there's disabled parking, and we're hoping um, there's a sign going to go onto the wall of the Thistle opposite, um, right. which we've which we've not had currently. Right. So I think that should help raise our profile once we get that put Good. up and onto the wall. Right? Are you, are you going to have one at the end of the uh, end of the road? Because a lot of people don't know exactly where you are. Uh, well, no, that's exactly right. Mm. Um, I mean, we tell people where we are, but mm. because we're we're only a couple of hundred yards down the road from the, the main city centre, that's right. But it's just knowing that we're there. But hopefully, the the sign will definitely um, well, it'll have an arrow as well. <laughs> so oh, good. Point people here. The, the, fl- um, the flashing arrow. <laughs> 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 that would be good. I don't think we're going to be allowed to have a flashing arrow, <laughs> but that would be worth it. <laughs> I think that's a great idea. <laughs> yeah, well, anything to get people down there. That's the, that's the trouble. You can go past it quite easily because the hill yeah. is so slope um but you've got to stop <laughs> yeah absolutely but again once we find like yourselves and others that once people have been here and discovered it they yeah. come back again and again it's well, just the finding us to start with well you just you do that on a recommendation you probably get the better people actually oh yeah absolutely we've got lots of lovely regulars who come in all the time chris included i will add oh, yeah, chris, um chris, so chris, you know it's 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 nice because it's a it's a mm. nice place for people to drop in it's a bit mm. like cheers you know the, the yes. program from years ago That's, where yeah. everybody knows your name it's, it's a bit like that <laughs> well everybody knows chris's name <laughs> yeah oh they most certainly do yeah <laughs> Well, thank you very much for talking to me because it's actually great because that's the sort of place which I'm going to come down there in just a moment or two, shall we say another half an hour, and I shall be down for my coffee. Excellent. Well, we look forward to seeing you soon. Okay. Thank you very much indeed. Okay. Thank Thank you. you. Bye. Bye.